Today we're going to discuss the installation best practices when applying Belbian architectural finishes to a tabletop. The first and most important step to any Belbian installation is to make sure you're working with a smooth, non-porous surface. A rough surface should be sanded completely and then cleaned with isopropyl alcohol. When pre-cutting material for the desk, be sure to cut enough material to cover not only the top of the desk, but the sides as well. Prior to applying Belbian to your surface, be sure to apply the adhesive promoter to your substrate. The adhesive promoter only needs to be applied to plane changes, complex curves, and where the material ends. Belbian features a pressure sensitive adhesive backing. When first applying the Belbian, be sure to only expose a small amount of the adhesive on the back of the material. Then adhere that small area to the substrate. Once you've confirmed that you have sufficient coverage for the entire application area, you can then remove the remaining liner from the Belbian and begin the application process. When applying Belbian, be sure to slowly pull the liner away from the material. This ensures that the Belbian does not prematurely stick to itself or to the substrate. While slowly pulling the liner away from the material, utilize overlapping squeegee strokes to activate the adhesive and adhere the Belbian to the substrate. After applying Belbian to the entire desktop, it's time to wrap the sides. The first step to wrapping the sides of the desktop is to utilize a relief cut on all four corners. After all four relief cuts have been performed, you're going to want to wrap the sides one by one. The first side should be wrapped slowly, starting from the 90 degree turn down. Once the side is wrapped, you'll want to cut off your excess material from the corner and then move on to the next side. The bottom and corners of this desktop are both areas that are considered exposed edges. You'll want to trim these areas with a knife held at a 45 degree angle. By holding the knife at a 45 degree angle, you'll bevel that edge and a properly beveled edge will help prevent material from peeling. We highly recommend that all the exposed edges that have just been cut at a 45 degree angle are then finished with a sanding block. With outward strokes away from the material, you can take a sanding block and bevel the edges that much further. This is the ideal way to finish off any exposed edge. We hope that you found our Belbian desktop installation tutorial informative and educational. If you have any other questions regarding a desktop installation, please contact us. Our information will be at the end of this video. Thank you.